Hey guys. Hey guys. Welcome back to our channel. <laughs> uh, first off, thank you guys for watching. Second, we hope you guys enjoy this video. Good morning, guys. We're heading in right now and we're going to drop these dudes off. I'm going to go take Jackson in real quick. I think these guys were trying to get these trucks onto the track and they were working on it for a bit when we showed up the first time to drop Jackie off. And when we came back through, they were still trying to get it back on there again. So I guess they gave up and they waited until there was less traffic. Mm -hmm. Today we're going to replace this window. It does not function properly, so we're going to put another one in. Mama Bear is going to put it in. <laughs> So we got the window out. This is three feet by three feet. Thank you. You're welcome. Couldn't really film that, but I helped Brennan put in the window. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for helping me. You're welcome. This would have been impossible trying to hold the window and put all these in at the same time. <laughs> so we cut the 45 on this 2x4. And we cut off 35 and a quarter inches of it. Awesome. We got all the boards up. Yeah. Looks pretty nice. Don't look so bad now. We had to cock the corners on it. So as soon as that dries, we're going to get it painted. Maybe tomorrow. Now the window's more secure. All right, guys, so we finished up with the window. The owner of the house had a problem with that window and it wasn't locking. It was kind of warped up a bit, a little weird, I don't know. But we just pulled the old one out instead of trying to repair that one, he went and bought a new window. So we went over and um, removed the old window and then we realized what was wrong with the structural integrity of the frame. So then we fixed that, we added the new window and then we added another frame around the window for extra security and it just looked a lot cleaner so came out pretty good now we're gonna go ahead to the boys we're gonna make one stop and it seems like traffic is not agreeing with the mama bear so <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna make a quick stop and then we're gonna head over and get these dudes there's a little bit of a backup on i-40 going eastbound through gallup I think they're doing construction on one of the bridges over there, so it's causing a problem. We were going to stop by Popeye's, but we didn't. We actually went to um, Subway. So, I got a 6-inch because um, I want to eat tonight dinner. Well, I want to eat every night, but I got a 6-inch with um, tuna toasted with some spinach, pepperoncinis, and some provolone cheese. And this here is Mama Bear's sandwich. Yay. No meat. Stop for gas. We're at Alsip's. We went in for some uh, drinks for the boys. Some juice and some gas. Michael and Draven are in the truck. So we're heading back to the house. We're going to change and unwind from the day, both us and the boys. 
um, so once we get the unwinding out and then we get everything put away and get all our school stuff done, we'll change and we're going to head back into town. We are going to go to Warren and Sue's tonight for dinner. So Sue is going to make us some acorn dumplings. And I'm under the impression that it's like a traditional Apache style um, meal. So it's going to be awesome. We can't wait. Yes. There's always such a nice view when we're driving down this road right here. Throughout all the seasons, this looks good. We are just taking off from the house, and for the first time in a while, when we're leaving in the evening time, we have all the boys. Hello. We're heading over to Warren and Sue's right now for dinner, and these guys are gonna go because a lot of their friends live right there in the same area, so it's gonna be a good time. They're gonna have fun, we're gonna have fun. Should be all right. The weather got a little crazy. It's uh, not snowing yet, but it got a little chilly though. Yes, it did. We're here at Warren's house. <laughs> Mom already found the puppy. My buddy grew up too fast. This is the magic stew. Yeah, and Pat. Patsy Gold. made some for Pam too, so there's no meat in that one. That's really awesome. Yeah. Thank you guys. There's no beef broth in that one, so. And here's Warren. You guys know Warren? What's up? And Jojo? you guys know Sue. Hi. Jojo's at work, so. Yeah, we saw him at work earlier. Told him we're going to go over to your house tonight. And he's like, for tattoos? <laughs> no, for food. And here we find him at the school. Only a handful at a time. He doesn't have the caps on. <gasps> so this is acorn stew. And what's the meat that's in here? Uh, it's just a regular beef roast. Beef, nice. What kind of meat do you have in yours, Mama? Uh, acorn. <laughs> we are leaving for Warren and Sue's now. Uh, we had a, quite a nice evening. Very um, nice. We were talking for a little bit, and of course when I'm talking it turned into like a lot of bit. So we were there for like three hours, four hours, 6.30 6 to 6.30. 30, yeah. So we were there talking for like four yeah. hours, but dinner was pretty good, and we appreciate them inviting us over, especially for something cultural, like um, that's the first time we ever had acorn dumplings and it's a, an apache dish so yes. we are very happy we got to try that out very and uh, we definitely thank them for inviting us over yeah, we, thank like you I said, very much like I said we had a pretty good time the boys had a good time they always have a good time when we go to Warren's um, so we're gonna set up tattoos for Thursday so right now we're heading home we don't have to worry about dinner if we do and we're gonna head back to the house and did you leave the heater on? I did okay House is warm. Yeah, it's freezing. <laughs> it is freezing. So we're heading home now, and I think this is going to be it for the remainder of our evening. So when we get back, we're just going to do a little straightening up, and we're going to get ready for bed for school tomorrow. So you guys all have a wonderful evening. We'll catch you guys in the morning. Later. Good morning, everybody. Today's Wednesday. The boys are all getting ready, and... Uh, we're almost ready to go. It is snowing again, you guys. It is 30 degrees right now, and um, the snow is coming down, but it seems to be just blowing off the ground as well, so it doesn't really stay in one spot. It's a little, little breezy, quite a bit chilly out there. But we're heading in. You can't see the mountain up there, or the hill, the ridge. I don't know what it is. picked us up last night. Uh, Sue made some more shirts for us. So now the boys have some. It's going to be awesome. Soon we'll get a picture with all of us together. Look at the tire. The back tire's on the track there. The... <laughs> I 
After a couple of little stops along the way, we find ourselves driving through downtown Gallup again. We're gonna head down to the east side. We're gonna go hit up Busy D. <laughs> yes. Laundry time. We're gonna go do the laundry. And it's easier for us to do this when the boys are at school. Even though Draven helps a lot. Um, and Michael usually stays out of the way. <laughs> <laughs> So, I'm going to help Mama Bear with the laundry today. And Jackson and you asked for equal amounts of things to eat, so... That's why we're going to Busy Bee? Yeah. <laughs> yes. Busy Bee has the nachos and hot dogs. <laughs> <laughs> well, if I pass out, I can't do the laundry. <laughs> Downtown looks a little busy today, huh? Yeah. Today is March 1st, which explains oh. why Gallup is a little busy today. Oh man, what a perfect time to do laundry. Oh man, uh. Well, we're gonna go down to Busy Bee and we're gonna see if we're gonna do the laundry today. <laughs> okay. A little something to munch before we do this laundry. I was thinking of getting a hot dog or some nachos, but I'm gonna get this instead. Thanks for stopping, Mama Bear. You're welcome. Some Long John Silvers. <laughs> we are just leaving Busy Bee Laundry, right? The laundry didn't happen that fast. No. As soon as we got to the parking lot, Mama Bear backed it in. I took a couple of bites, and then uh, my mom texted. I eventually called her because I know where this is going. So we just got right to the point, asked my mom what she needed, and uh, she said she needs a ride. So we're like, cool, we don't got a problem with that. So we're gonna cruise out there. We just didn't want to start the laundry and then we a ride after that and then have to wait. So I had to figure it out before we did the laundry. And now we're gonna go drive out to Rock Springs real quick, take my mom to go do what she needs to do, and take her back home. Then we're gonna come back in and we'll see if there's enough time to do the laundry before we pick the boys up. <laughs> Mama Bear's in charge of the laundry, it happens right away. If I'm like, hold on, we need to do this, and we need to do this. These bags, they're gonna get done tomorrow, look. In the middle of winter, when we're trying to walk to the parking lot with them. Yeah. Middle of winter, in the middle of a snowstorm again. That was a quick on and off on I-40. Yeah. We went out to Rock Springs and we picked up my mom. We are heading over to Wally World real quick. And then I think we're gonna go back across to the gas station. gas station <laughs> extra 15 miles yes <laughs> extra 15 miles <laughs> you cannot see the Chiska Mountains today mm. looks like it's snowing pretty good between here and Tehachi yeah. we find ourselves at TNR Market again <laughs> We're just leaving Rock Springs now. We're heading back into Gallup and uh, the alarm's gonna go off here in a few minutes to pick up Jackson. So we took my mom into Gallup. We ended up at Walmart. We walked around for a bit and picked up things that my mom needed. We picked up things that we needed, or I did. And uh, we went after that. After that, we went to TNR and she mailed off what she needed to mail off. We walked around some more. We picked up a couple more things. So after that, we took my mom back to the house and after we took the stuff in, we said what's up to my little brother and we rolled out. So now we're heading back to Gallup. We're gonna go probably just cruise it down to the west side and pick up the baby. We don't need to like, hurry down there, so I don't know if we need to make any stops. We also stopped for gas. 
Yeah. And so we don't need to stop for gas. Um, I got a monster at Walmart. Got Mama a strawberry. We didn't get dinner stuff. Strawberry stuff. fresca. Oh, crap. We oh. <laughs> when we were going to Walmart, my mom was going to be in and out. And uh, when I hopped off, we hopped off at the door because my mom's legs hurt. My mom hurt her knee. So it's kind of hard for her to like walk to the parking lots or walk for a long time. So we ended up um, hopping off at the door, and I told Mama Bear, like, we'll be right out. <laughs> and we ended up uh, in there for like an hour, 40 minutes, I don't know, it was a long time, an like an hour. But, I don't know, we picked up a lot of things that we needed. Easter stuff for the boys. And it gave Mama Bear a break. <laughs> a break from what? From your husband. <laughs> I don't need a break from you. <laughs> I bet she was bored. <laughs> and uh, I didn't even text her until I was almost done. I was like, all right, we're almost done. And it was all an hour later. Quick stop at Lou's. We gotta get some dinner stuff, I guess. We made it down to Jackson School. And it's a little windy outside and it's kinda cold, so I'm gonna go run in and grab Jackson. I will be right back out. It's very windy and it's very cold. <laughs> I got Jackie. I like his best life shirt. It's snowing again down there, you guys. Next batch. Next batch. <laughs> next batch. So we got a quick little dinner here. This looks delicious. We like these sausages. Like, we eat hot dogs, and we tried these, and when Mama Bear cooked them for us, these were really good. Of course, you gotta have it with the beans. And these fries, these fries actually look pretty good. It is later on in the evening, and what are you doing, Mama Bear? I'm gonna have a snack, since I did not have dinner. <laughs> I found these at TNR. And you like them? Yes. Those are pretty good, huh? Yes. <laughs> Earlier, the boys and I had dinner, we had the hot dogs and the fries. Mama Bear had like a handful of fries, but she didn't eat any dinner. So she's gonna have a snack right now. <laughs> Morning, guys. Today's Thursday. We had virtual day today. It was a two hour delay, then it was virtual learning day. So we got the boys up, got the ready and everything. and. Uh, I got the message right when Jackson should have been in classes when I got another message that said that class is canceled altogether today. So, no school today. But I do have to go to town because I got to go check um, a cable. It's a power cable from a generator to a food trailer. Um, I got to go see what's wrong with that. But right now, Mama Bear's getting ready and Jackson's hungry. So, I'm cooking him some breakfast real quick. And then we'll get on with our day. Check it out, Draven. Ham and cheese omelet. Mm. I need a little bit of salt and some Tabasco. I just made a mess of Mama's stove, so I gotta clean it. <laughs> but I found the Tabasco. And here it is the ham and cheese omelet with a little bit of hot sauce. Mm. Mama Bear's done getting ready. And she don't trust me with her grilled cheese. What? I'm just kidding. You can't make me one. <laughs> She's done fixing her hair. This looks really awesome. <laughs> Getting ready before we head in. So we are ready now. We're going to take off to town and uh, we have to go check this wire cable 
It's like a plug, a really, really big plug. It's for mm -hmm. the taco trailer from the generator. We're gonna go see what happened to it and see how we're gonna fix it. The boys don't wanna to go to town right now, but they wanna go this evening. So we're gonna come back and get them and then we're gonna head in and do the tattoo this evening. Mm -hmm. This morning we were getting ready to take off and um, Mama Bear was braiding my hair for me. And normally she braids it and then I'm just listening to whatever I was watching. This morning it was uh, some uh, <laughs> some more Tomcat videos. We were listening to like some war history stuff and she was braiding my hair and normally she's braiding my hair like I don't know what she's doing. She's just braiding my hair. But today she braided my hair and then when I finally looked at it when I was getting a jacket I actually seen that it was braided with a design in it and it looks really awesome. I think it looks pretty cool. It looks pretty awesome. Now we have matching hairstyles. Now we have matching hairstyles. <laughs> wow. I like that. <laughs> hmm. Thank you. You're welcome. I love you. I love you. That's cool. I didn't even think about that. <laughs> I love it. It looks like I-40 West has opened back up. They closed it last night and all these truckers and tourists had to get off and gallop and apparently it's been pretty packed all morning. We're in town now. The weather does not look too bad, but it doesn't look that good either. <laughs> of course we can't see the whole north side of Gallup right now. Yeah. That's crazy. Seems as if we're heading into the storm. Sure does. Made it over here. I see what the problem is. Um, the rest of this is still in the trailer, plugged in. This was plugged in when he drove off yesterday. Oh, no. <laughs> so we got to get the other piece out and then uh, put it back together and make it secure, I guess. Uh -oh. So we've got this piece out, and this is the one that connects to that piece right there. All of this got damaged, too, when it got pulled out. We have to rewire all these in here, and... Because it was pulled out, it kind of damaged how it was mounted. So I'm going to flip everything around and I'm remounting it with all new holes. So it should hold. We should be good. The snow's starting to melt. No, the road is probably getting messy <laughs> in the house. Huh? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> so let's cruise back in. We checked what we need to up there so we can modify this. There's no need to now. Okay. Let's go in. We have finished the taco trailer. The refurbishing was a success. Mm -hmm. We took it apart. We found where it was broken. We fixed it. We reassembled it. We checked it for sturdiness and we made sure it worked. So now that it works, we took off from there and we are downtown. We are going to run into Denny Pino's. I have to pick up some needles and tubes for this tattoo this evening. This is usually where I buy my tattoo equipment if I'm not ordering in bulk online. We got a couple of things. We made it back to the house and uh, the boys are eating right now. They all want to jump in when we head back to Warren so we're going to head over there here in a second. Mama Bear, are you starting on something before we leave? Yes. Are you sure it's plugged in this time? <sighs> yeah. That's the first thing I did was plug it in, and then I turned it on. Last time was horrible. I, <laughs> well, it was before school, so maybe I was still sleepy. I just threw everything in there, and I put it on high. And when we came back, <laughs> I guess I forgot to plug it in. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, Mama Bear, that looks full. Yeah, I need a bigger one. <laughs> you need a family size one? Mm-hmm. We are piling in here now. Well, me and Draven and Jackson are in here. I don't know what Michael's doing, but Mama Bear is doing the final check on making sure everybody got the lights off and stuff. Even if I do it, she's just going to come behind me and make sure it's done anyway. <laughs> 
It's kind of wild getting out of here again. It's worse than when we came home. This train was kind of a long one. We have arrived over here at Warren's house. We're gonna get started on this tattoo here in a bit. I was gonna stencil it out, but I wanna see what we're working with, and I think it's a lot easier for me if I just draw it on his back. Just if I do the script on his back with the marker and um, tattoo that. So we're here with Warren, and uh, on his back, I just mapped it out on the paper real quick. I'm actually gonna um, put some lines on his back, and then we're gonna handwrite everything on there. We're gonna do it a few times until we get everything right. So. <laughs> and uh, he's so, got a time lapse, so on his channel he'll have this too going. The whole thing he'll, he'll probably have it out way sooner than we do because I'm I'm like a week behind on <laughs> what I'm putting out. But we're gonna get started on this, so uh, we'll keep you guys uh, posted on what's going on with it. Can't wait, man. This is like my therapy. <laughs> this is like my therapy. It's like uh, <clears throat> I don't know. It's like all the stress, everything that builds up in me. This is like my time to let it go. There's no alcohol. There's no nothing like that. I just, this is the way I let it go. And this is the way I feel better. So I'm glad I'm going to enjoy it. Um, I don't think it's going to hurt too much. You know, I'll, the back tattoos don't usually hurt. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll know it out really quick. I usually do that. That's what I did with this one right here. Oh, well, the last back that we did. <laughs> that was different. My back tattoo hurt. But I'm sure, I'm sure I'll know it out. Mama Bear said her back tattoo hurt. Yeah. Which one? My lower back. Warren's oh. probably not going to go that low, but... <laughs> you hear that? I'm his dealer. Or I'm his therapist. Yeah, however you want to look at it. <laughs> so if I get quiet, I don't say nothing. You know, it's just me just, just letting everything out. out. Yeah. If he passes out, whoever's here is going to tattoo him. <laughs> Mama Bear's taking off to the mall with Michael right now. Yeah. So it's going to be Jackson and Nebea. One of them will tattoo him if he passes yeah. out. Don't forget about Draven. <laughs> Draven took off Draven already. took off to his house. So I don't know if we're going to even see him until I'm done with the tattoo. Yeah, He's I the one we've got to worry about. I don't know if the turn goes Oh, yeah. It looks like they're rolling up right now. So here, I went to go get me caffeine. Little caffeine, caffeine thing. So. I showed up with mine. And a backup. <laughs> <laughs> We're two hours in right now, and I tore a glove, so we're taking a break. We both had to get up and stretch our backs a bit. Mama Bear came back, but she had to take off again to go pick up some other stuff for tonight, so Jackson's still in the room. Mama Bear took off with Michael again. So we're taking a break. We're two hours in. We're probably like halfway, I don't know. The line work's taking a bit. The shading and the coloring shouldn't take too long, or the shading and filling. So I'll probably shade the tips and look what, see what it looks like tip shaded, and then I'll fill them all in if he doesn't want to do that. We'll probably just do them all black, I don't know. We finally got done with the black on it. Just got to clean it up real quick. We got done with the tattoo at Warren's earlier. And um, the tattoo took way longer than I thought. But it was also way bigger than I thought it was going to be. But uh, we never have a problem with that. I like, I like hanging out there. I like tattooing with bro Warren. But we got back to the house. And uh, it's a little bit later than we had anticipated when we left. But that means the roast is done. And uh, I'm so hungry right now. This is what Mama Bear got set up for us before we rolled out. This is going to be so good. Was it good, Michael? It was amazing. Awesome. Michael's already done the plate. Holy cow. This food. <laughs> this food is so, so good. Mm. The pot roast. <laughs> Love you. I don't even kiss her with my meat lips. What? The pot roast is so soft. What? These potatoes. These potatoes I love so much because they have um, the skin still on it. And usually when Mama bakes the potatoes, I'll eat mine like a hot dog while everybody will like mix it and scoop it out and eat it and eat the skin. I usually just close mine back up and eat the whole thing because I like the peelings on it. So these are really good. One, and of two, course, two. corn on the cob. Corn on the cob is always good. Thank you, Mama Bear. You're welcome. All right, you guys, that's going to be it for this video. Like always, thanks for watching. Thank y'all for the love and the support you guys continue to show us. And you guys have a nice rest of your day. See you guys later. Take care. Peace. <laughs>